Hi, I'm Miss June, one of the art teachers in Sri Dash Mesh, and today I'm going to share with you what IGCSE art and design is all about. First thing first, what is art? Art is a visual communication where we convey our message and ideas visually. In IG art, students are exposed to various techniques and mediums, equipping them with hands on skills and knowledge so that they can produce artworks required by Cambridge. Now let me show you some artworks produced by students so that you can understand this further. So these are some of the works done by students in Malaysia and they scored a grade between A to A star. It shows a deep understanding of the topic that they were doing and they show various mediums and techniques which they have learned in class. So this is what Cambridge is looking for very refined, detailed, well-presented artworks. So some students may want to major in interior designing, fashion designing, game designing, graphic designing. They may want to check with the universities if they need to produce portfolios because some university requires them to produce portfolios. And IGCSE art would be a good year for them to produce portfolios required by the universities. I hope you have enjoyed the slideshows shown. Thank you. This is an actual A2 size artwork and students are required to produce artworks like these. With proper guidance and effort put in by students, I'm pretty sure they'll be able to produce artworks like these. Art and design in IGCSE is a fun-based project subject and do consider it. Thank you. Why study ICT? Information and communication technology is a constantly developing subject within society. By understanding and being able to use the tools that ICT provides, we are better able to solve problems and work more efficiently. Students develop an understanding of the implications of technology in society and the ways ICT can help at home, work and the wider world. Through practical and theoretical studies, students solve problems using a variety of common software such as word processes and interactive presentation software. Learners will analyze, design, implement, test and evaluate ICT systems making sure that they are fit for purpose. There is an emphasis on developing lifelong skills which are essential across the curriculum and their future career. With that, let's welcome the Year 10s on board. Three. Hi!